Excuse me, sir. Can we have a short interview with you? Sorry, I'm not interested. Why did you become a hunter? Is it a dream of yours? No, I don't really have dreams. Are you doing it for your family? It must be tough at your age. No. Also, I'm the only person in my family. That's rough. Cut this out. Let's do another take. Recently, there have been complaints of hunters destroying public facilities under the pretense of eliminating wanderers. I'm sorry. My mission partner is waiting for me. I need to get to work. You have already formed quite the impression of me. Looks like everyone's here. Come on over. We've been observing the fluctuations from last night. We also have the results from the protocore data you sent back. This is the protocore you sent this morning. I'm sure you've noticed it's been modified. Getting along, I see. The blue line is the protocore's original protocurve. The red one shows it's been modified. We initially wanted to analyze the protocurve to determine the protocore's origin, but after searching the system database three times, none of the data matched up. Believe it or not, we've never seen anything like it. It's possible there's a protocol even the Association isn't aware of. It also might serve another purpose. It's a gift from Anakinus. Obviously, they know more about this protocol than we do. We need to obtain more samples to get more information about this unknown protocol. In order to do that, we'll have to use our evil. You know what her evil can do. It'd be good if she's willing to help us. Since Anakinus is involved, it'll be dangerous. Risks are par for the course. If you help, we'll provide you full support and protection. You'll have a partner to assist you as well. Speak.
Yes, but the methods used to modify them were crude. The potential damage they could have caused was minor at best. This time it's different. The energy shown in that abnormal protocurve is beyond our current understanding of protocores. The benefits a protocore provides are certainly tempting for groups like Anakinus. But the exact goal Anakinus wants to achieve by modifying protocores is still unknown. We speculate it's not about money, given Silas's track record. He's the leader of Anakinus. Finding unknown protocores isn't something that can be done overnight. Today was just a small glimpse of what the overall mission would look like. Think about it. You worked hard last night. Take the next two days off. You need to decide whether or not you'll help the Hunters Association find those protocors. I don't know a lot about it, I just know its name. If you want, you can call it a protocore nexus, Fluxstone, or Terra Stelle, if you like. My advice is that you don't join at all. Really? So I'm just a tool. Regardless of what you think, Unicorns has a lot of ways to get things done. Your evil might not be their only option. Don't stress about it. You might enter a world that's beyond your wildest imagination. I should have known I couldn't scare you away. Maybe I'm here to convince you to live with no regrets. 
Anything involving Anakinus is complicated. Who knows if the Hunters Association will refuse to tell you about the dangers that lie ahead. I was worried you wouldn't give it much thought and agree right away, and choose someone else to be your partner. I see. If you do get involved in the end, then could you choose me as your partner? Like we're being cautious is always a smart move. It's just a minor setback.
Ding, ding, ding. Wake up. You can do it. Ding, ding, ding. Wake up. You can do it. <laughs>